Hey you guys, what's up, see you Blaze, back with another video, and today I'm going to be showing you this uh, amazing, or I'm going to be building a car, I don't really know which car I'm going to build yet, but I'm going to be building a car and see, like, if we can try and make it like a good drag car or a drift car or something like that, I haven't chosen the car yet, but uh, yeah, so I'm going to go and grab, in, grab that quickly, but just before that, I just want to quickly say, if you haven't already joined with our club, make sure to, we're doing really good, we're in the top 5,000 at the moment, well, just below top 5,000. Uh, we 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 go getting really high in terms of XP. Uh, we started off this week with about 30 million XP, and we're now about 50 million. So we're just kind of killing it slowly. We're getting up there slowly. And uh, yeah, but let's just get straight into this video. So, like I said today, we're going to be building a car. I'm not really too sure what car we're going to build. So um, yeah, I'm just going to go and find a car real quick. And I'll see you guys when we're done. Okay, I've already found my car. Um, yeah, this is an Alfa Romeo. I've seen this car, some drifted before, but it's not the best drift car, so I kind of want to see if I can throw this sideways and see what we can get. So, obviously, we're going to need a bit more horsepower than that. V8 would do good. Uh, do we chuck all drive in it? That's a question. It makes it a lot better, faster. Yeah, I'm going to chuck all drive in it. I'm, this is going to be like an angle car. Uh, obviously we want all the horsepower we can get, so we're just going to put all the horsepower options in. Uh, no, we're not going to go with that. Are we going to go with that? Uh, it does improve the handling, so I might. Okay, yeah, I just throw all those on. Uh, makes the car slightly better in terms of handling, so we we'll always want that. I didn't realise there was a Horizon uh, set of rims in this car. That makes the acceleration lower, but it's always better because it gives you slightly more grip. And I'm just going to change these rims, those rims look horrible. And go with something like those, these look even worse, but it's still better than the other ones. Um, yeah, okay, right, so we're going to chuck the race clutch in it, we're going to put the race transmission. Uh, race drip, diff, yeah, that'd be good. Race drive line, drive train, should I say even. Uh, braking, yeah, we need some good braking in this car. One thing I did just realise, this car is extremely high, isn't it? There we go. Okay, that's better. Um, yeah, let's just throw all this in and just kind of hope it'll work, really. Acceleration, that's going to put the acceleration down, it's going to make the braking better. So that's always good. Uh, we're going to put all the upgrades in terms of car in the engine in this car. So, um, yeah, it's really good, kind of just like. In terms of like speed and stuff like that, this is going to be like a kind of higher speed angle drift car, if that makes any sense. Kind of does. Uh, anyway, yeah, 6.8 speed, it hasn't got the best speed, but I might tune this car, obviously. Well, we're going to have to tune this car a little bit to kind of push out them as much as we can in terms of like push out as much horsepower and stuff as we can. So let's go and get that. 1000 horsepower seems about good. Um, Obviously, I'm going to go and tune this. I might time lapse me tuning this, since obviously it's going to take a bit of time. So I've got to get used to kind of like how this car drives and stuff like that. So uh, yeah, I'm going to jump into a time lapse while I'm uh, tuning it, and I'll see you guys after that time lapse. just go over and throw this car around I got the speed up from it was originally 185 and that's 233 which definitely means we can get some high speed kind of like drifts and stuff like that going so um yeah I'm gonna just drive down this uh, straight here and get my speed up and then we're gonna throw it about now right there's the angle maybe a little bit too much angle I mean oh can we hold it can we hold it no, that was so close. Imagine if we held that and just uh, pulled it around that corner. That would be amazing. But um, yeah, let's see if we can kind of get some cool reverse entries. 
see, I think it might have a little bit too much speed. I'm not sure. No, it's not too bad. Uh, let's see if we can rip it around this corner. Kind of. It's okay, it's not the best. Um, yeah, I might go and download someone else's tune and see if, see how they've got it. Uh, but yeah, for now I'm just going to try and like throw this car. This is more like an angle speed car, like I said. So uh, yeah, see. Nice, nice, nice. Can we hold it? Can we hold it? No, my gears are a bit... My gears aren't the best, but I do want to keep those gears the same because obviously it allows us to have top speed. And like I said, this is a speed angle uh, drift. So yeah, we do need that bit more speed. But uh, yeah, let's see if we can 360 this. Alright, 360 is amazing. Okay, well that wasn't the best because obviously there was a car coming towards me. But if I can kind of find a bit more of a straight and definitely throw down a 360. Yeah, it rips it. Okay, 360. Oh, oh my, what is this? Oh, that was so close, I thought we were going to hold it then. I was going to say, we literally, what did we even do there? I think we hit the top of the uh, rock bit, and then it sent me up in the air while doing a 360, and then I nearly held onto it, what it's like right now. Okay, nice, nice. Wet slides, nice. Uh, no, okay, we've, we've messed it up, we've gone up the hill. Okay, right, so, let's see if we can rip it around these few corners here. Yeah. It definitely does hold the drift quite well, considering it's like a... It's not really meant to be a drift car, really, is it, to be fair? There is better cars than this that drift, but they're not meant to be drift cars, like the uh, Shelby... Cobra, that is definitely an amazing drift car, that can really hold the kind of angle, but I think this car definitely is quite good considering it only has 1000 horsepower, and it's only an alpha, it's not really made to kind of drift well and be fast, so I definitely think this is quite a good car, it does hold it quite well as you guys can see there, um, right, let's see if we can, no, we've gone flying into the bushes, okay, right, let's try that again then quickly. Right, let's see. We can throw it down here. Let's see what points we kind of get in the drift zone, really. Let's see. Twenty K, it's actually not too bad. Fifty K? Mad. Okay, right, we need to quickly spin this back around before we lose it, but uh yeah, 50k is not bad at all, considering it's like this kind of car. I don't know, maybe you guys can probably do better than that. Obviously, I did try and do this tune quickly. But 50k for this kind of car is not too bad, actually. No, I don't care about bucket list challenges. Right. Let's see if we can throw around this corner well and hold it. Yeah, you can definitely hold a drift in this car very well, unless you hit into someone else's car like that. Uh, just don't hit any BMWs, uh, it just flings you off the road. But yeah, see what I mean, it can definitely hold angle very well. So uh, yeah, I think we have accomplished this. Obviously we've got quite high speeds, kind of, well, kind of high speeds. And we're obviously going to kind of throw it. Uh, the only problem, like I said, is the gearing. The gearing's not the best. I mean, you have to kind of continuously take the gears down while drifting it's kind of awkward but uh yeah it's not too bad you can definitely hold some angle in it and um yeah so i think this might actually be one of my favorite cars like uh, cars in terms of i've built that drift and stuff like that next i think i want to do a kind of high speed drift build in something like this or a top speed build uh, maybe maybe in, like a fear or something i don't know you guys can comment down below your what you want to see next whether it be like a high speed drag car or a high acceleration drag car or anything really like that uh, that you want to see or maybe like a, a good cruise car or one of the best cruise cars to make or stuff like that. I don't really know. Whatever you guys want to see, comment it down below and I'll definitely read through the comments and see what you guys kind of want from me. 
or want me to do next. So uh, yeah, if you haven't already, make sure to like this video down below. See if we can break five likes as we always uh, go for. I've always wanted to go for that lob, but I don't know if you can. Uh, anyway, yeah, make sure to subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Let's see if we can break 150 subscribers soon. Um, let's also see if we can. What else could we do? <laughs> uh, share this video if you have, if you haven't. Uh, let's see if we can get three shares on this video because I don't know. I like to just like seeing the shares go up. To be fair, but um, yeah, let's see if we, we can break three shares on this video. And oh, that was amazing if we could hold that. So I mean, the gearing is not the greatest on this car, but uh, yeah. Anyway, as I was saying, make sure to like the video, subscribe to the channel, share, and that's all I have uh, for today. I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. If you have and you want to download this tune, I'll put this tune up on the uh, tune on the uh, on the store, so you guys can go and get it. My game tag is obviously up the top there. So if you guys want to go and download this tune, then you can from the, the thing. I don't really know what I'm going to call it, but just search for a game tag and you should find it. But yeah, that is the end of the video, guys.